Hello, my name is Mike Till and I am the lead sales engineer here at NOPS. Today, we will be discussing the cost control tool within the application. With the complexity of AWS billing, it is imperative to understand exactly where your cost centers are. With the ability to view your spend from an account level perspective, all the way down to usage type and tags, you can feel rest assured that NOPS will assist in providing clarity. To start at the very top, if you want a certain perspective, you can select any of the tabs which will show you costs from that viewpoint. Right now, we are looking at AWS accounts specifically, but if you wanted to look at resources, you select the resources tab, and then you can see your costs broken down by resource. Same thing goes for managed services, so things like EC2s and S3 buckets. You can even break it out by tags. This will help you account for costs across your tagging hierarchy, as well as things that are currently untagged. So you can go back and clean that up if needed. We're gonna cycle back to the AWS accounts for this demonstration. At the very top, we have our AWS spend summary. This displays your total spend from yesterday, the total spend from the previous week, and the overall month to date spend. This also includes comparisons to the historical spend within the respective timeframes. Down below that, we have our stacked bar graph breaking out your costs across your entire AWS consolidated bill for the last 30 days for easy reference. We can even provide a quick forecast based on your current spend trends. Down at the bottom, we have your standard table breaking out your costs even further. This displays your total costs for the last 30 days and is quite interactive. You can sort by clicking the headers at the top, search for specific content, as well as export the report in CSV format. If you are looking for even further detail, you can select the specific items within the table, which brings up a deeper understanding of your costs. This will present every resource that accrued cost that day, as well as operation, usage types, and tags. The filters on the left-hand side allows you to customize what is presented in the report. You can set a custom time frame, one or all AWS accounts, exclude AWS credits, specify what resources were launched after or before a certain date, cloud formation, stack names, tags, regions, AWS managed services, operations, and lastly, usage types. You can even select certain things like data transfer costs, which can be a hassle to find in the Amazon console. Finally, the Change Management tab will display all the changes that have taken place within your environment around cost. With the ability to subscribe to this report, you can catch any spiking costs early before you are hit with sticker shock at the end of the month when your Amazon bill arrives. With NOPS, you can feel 100% confident understanding how your organization is spending money within AWS. By being able to dissect and break out your costs from various perspectives like tags, usage types, and resources, you can be confident in understanding your bill when it arrives.